This week's Cafe Critter is the Easter Bunny. I'm not making that up. <laughs> there he is. Hi, Laura Clark from the Watkins Humane Society. Good morning. It really is the Easter Bunny. Sadly, yes. So Easter was, what, six weeks ago? You yeah. called it. And about six weeks after Easter is when shelters all through the nation um, start getting the unwanted gifts that were bunnies, chicks, things like that. And so this is our first casualty, uh, well-meaning husband, although not very smart, sorry. <laughs> go with the chocolate. Always go with the chocolate bunny. <laughs> Brought the free bunny home to his wife for yeah. Easter. And she said, I do not want this bunny. So she brought it to us, very embarrassed and very angry with her husband. Oh. Um, so this is Pipkin. And I will date myself, but do you remember the old rabbit ears on your TV? Well, there's a reason they were called rabbit ears because they do this. So this guy's just five months old and he has not grown into his ears. He's adorable. Um, He's kind of that gangly teenager for a bunny. And he is so sweet. He loves people. He comes right to his cage in our small animal room. You open the door and he hops out and hops right over to you. He is going to make a fantastic companion for somebody. Still got some growing to do. Um, Very social. He loves his dark leafy greens. You guys were asking what is catnip for bunnies? Dark leafy greens, kale, parsley, that type of stuff. Well, carrots too, right? Carrots, but carrots have a lot of sugar in them, a lot of natural sugar, so you don't want to overload. Yeah. So go to rabbit.org, best website ever for rabbits and all things rabbits, and you can get a list of really great veggies. We grow them at the shelter for the small animals, so they have their own little garden. Nice. Very organic. Very organic of us, yes. And so this guy's just looking for somebody that wants to make him a family companion. He is using his litter box at the shelter. He's a smart little guy. Wow. Does he have gray hair? He does. It's kind of a funky little white and gray and brown and black, and his fur is so super soft. And I'm not sure what it's going to look like when he finally grows into everything, but it's the ears that you just can't get away from. They're just hilarious. So he's going to grow into them. He's, well, I don't know if he's actually going to grow all the way into them. <laughs> they they st- but big. isn't it fun because you can do this with them? <laughs> you can sit and just do that, and he doesn't seem to mind. He seems to like it. Does he like to be held? He is not a huge fan, but he will be held. The thing about bunnies and small toddlers is toddlers grab and pick up, and that's not a really great thing for bunnies. So a home with older kids would be a good bet for this guy. You got to lift from the bum with bunnies and support their bum and their their back so they don't hurt themselves because they kick. I was going to ask if I can hold him. Is that a bad idea? You certainly can. Now, he might poo on you. Ooh. So support the bum. Support the bum. Support the bum. Support the bum. Oh, he says, oh, oh. I gotcha. Does your bum feel supported? (laughs) I'm trying to be very supportive of your bum. (laughs) Oh, he's very soft. He's a nice little boy. Yeah. Okay, he needs a new home. He sure does. Pipkin, is there a story behind Pipkin? I believe he came with the name. Okay, very good. Well, he's awful cute. Oh, look at that. He's cuddly. Yeah. Yeah. It, am I does, distressing him here? Um, no, but he might nibble on you, and okay. he does have kind of sharp teeth, so just beware oh, about that. Wow. Well, this sounds exciting. <laughs> <laughs> well, hello. Okay. Um, and, and you are anticipating maybe more Easter bunnies coming in? We've got a lot of small animals. He's yeah. one of three bunnies we have right now. So if you're looking for small animals or any animals, come on down and see us. Okay. Well, he's very sweet. And he needs a new home. Maybe it's yours. Pipkin. Available now at the Watkins Humane Society. Laura Clark, thank you so much. Have a great week. You too. Thanks for letting me hold him. <laughs>